Well, today we've got in stealth mode. Still pretty damn dark. We've actually were around at the pots. We've come early because we had to get here before the tide got too high. Otherwise, the water it's, it's, it's slack now. In another 30 minutes, it's going to start to run, and once it starts racing, it just won't go through the pots. So we thought we'd come around early, get it done, and go out and fish a bit. A bit of a breeze, but it's only because it's coming down off the land at the moment. You get like a downdraft here. Right. Go and see. change though some days you get that you'll get a couple in one side and then also on the other pots will have loads and then you, you do the same the other next day you think oh that did well and then okay. you end up with the reverse Everyone just under, just under. There you go. Just under. Just under. And this one, I can tell this is just under as well. There you go. I'm not even going to bother wasting my time gauging it. Yeah, 
Yep, that one's size. We've got one. Are you going to need the gauge for those or not? Say they're well under, but I'm going to say they're just under as well. <laughs> Taking both out. Shell change, they'll all be over. Yeah. That's how close they are, you see. Shanker, but it would be legal if it's got one floor and it's very mottled, so we wouldn't bother with it. And that's it. Change that long because it's so blue. When you get a very blue like that, the shells aren't that old normally. Although it looks hard enough. Yeah, that's another one there, possible. Yeah. Again, you'll see that these were just unders that have changed their shells to be just over. Yeah. Because yeah. look at the colour of them. Yeah. But like I say, as long as the shell's hard, it's hard each around them. Yeah, that's hard enough. There's no flex there. That one that actually one. Another one? I didn't see that one. Wow, is that dead as well? well Look what they're doing to each other. Out. This it's is. Look at that. Again, it's another one. We've had three like this in the last couple of days, where the other lobsters are crushing them. There's so many lobsters, so many small lobsters. They end up fighting and killing each other. You see, there's four in here.
I know there's a lot of weed on the floor. But the tide should be slapping soon anyway. It's already going down an hour, an hour and a half. Look at this lot, and there's a lobster in there. Let's get that lobster out before he gets some mullard. I'll check his size, I don't, I don't think he's big enough, but... Look at the crab in that pot, mind you, I crammed it. Look, there's no bait at all left. I absolutely crammed this one. Uh, let me just check this lobster and throw it back, because I know it'll be too small. Oh, that's just under again. There you go, just under, broken claw on it. Alright, let's see how many's in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, 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 Twenty-seven, twenty-eight. Twenty-eight. Well, that's some kind of. That's the biggest one in there for those. Yeah. Uh, I've got to move the thing coming back onto a rock. Look at all the crabs going down. Hundreds of them. Still got a spider in there. They're hiding in the corner. That crab there would be well legal. I've already thrown one back that's legal. So that's a legal crab, but... Him. He's also a legal crab.
fish in there. Two fish in there. And a crab falling off the side. This is our fish pot. <laughs> Seems that way. This is what we use to catch the wrasse, as yeah. you see there. So, yeah. That's a clean spider, that one. It's only just arrived, I think. So, the little back the little wrasse. There's the wrasse that's in the pot. Oh, oh, he's in the bucket now. He was in the pot. Now he's in the bucket. Yeah, there's the one. You see, you even get the bends coming up in the pot. Get that little one out and get him back yeah, quick as you can. The red. Yeah, really clean one. Yeah, get that. Lovely. Get that um, fish out of the little ones, otherwise you don't stand a chance. Put him close to the boat. Well, it's an ink well and everything goes in, comes out again as far as I'm concerned. In fact, we put it quite high up, look, because look, it wouldn't have been far off from drying out actually. It's a bit high. It's funny if it comes up for a lot. No, it is actually down the side, look, it goes down there. Actually, this could be good. Yes, look, it goes right down the edge. It does dry out there though, that's the only thing I would say. I can't even see it coming off the bottom. So, let's get into the action. And here we are with Rebecca on the pulling, pull, pulling station. She's about to pull up an inkwell, hopefully full of lobster. The chances are very low, but you never know. We did have one yesterday, was it? Or day before? Day before, eh? Looks like there might be nothing in... Oh, I see an antenna! I see an antenna! Not a very big antenna, but it's an antenna. There you go. There's a Barbie lobster. Yep. And there he is. Yep, with one claw. Right, Shit. let it let it go. Let it go. Ready? Yeah, jump. No. <laughs> Anything else? Nothing? Yeah. Alright, any bait in that? Good. The thing is, these big tides aren't that big, so we can't 